Hey guys, Def Gun here. The one. No, the no. Uh, 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 uh. It's not Def Gun. It's, it is not. It is not Thunder Thighs either. Fine. We have a new nickname for him. I refer Thunder Thighs at nope. every. No. Nope. <laughs> he, he refers it now. His name, but, his name is Baby Hands. Baby Hands. Show your baby hands. See, look at it. The Thunder Thighs Kaiju. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Today, Lumberjack would like to introduce his updated version of his deck. Yep. Which for October it beat the Blue Eyes deck, which we thank you for doing. <laughs> yep. Uh, the Hillbilly is still trying. Blue as you, Eyes as you guys, Sour Plus. As you guys, as you guys saw that he's basically trying to come back after his deck was stolen, yes. but. Zombies are back. Uh, I like uh, this version is pretty much a lot funner, in my opinion. Um, a lot more consistent. Consistent. Uh, uh, Bearded Bastard hates it because I still play Rivalry, but it's such a cheap win. But still, I cut down Rivalry though, so instead of a three of and a two of. <laughs> All right, let's get in. Let's get into it. Starting off with two Baladrock. The the, bo the boss monster of the deck. Next is uh, two Banshee, the searcher of uh, of zombie world. Two Glow Bloom to get out your ball and drop the easiest way possible. Or add the hand. Or add, or even add Frawl Line. So I've done that a few times. Next is three Solitaire because you're playing zombies. You kind of have to play three, three solitaire. Next, three Unizombie to go with the solitaire. By the way, this is uh, what, what is what is he? This is this is a uh, baby hands in uh, card form. Card form, uh, the originator, whatever. Originator, Gaylord, whatever you want to call. There him. you go. That that guy. Virgin. Uh, they go hand in hand. Virgin Gaylord. <laughs> One Gozuki. Because sometimes you need that. Just another dump. To get things going. Yep. And then two Mizuki. Always feel great right after another dump. Yep. <laughs> and then basically, whenever you summon him, you're basically going to be dumping him. Well, one's a rare. And the other's a, a gold. I know. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Mismatch. <laughs> and then the other target you search off of uh, Froline. Well, it's Froline, but off of Gold Bloom, you add Froline. Which. Honestly, she has gotten me out of pinches a lot before. So you pay like pay up to 3k to boost up any mo any zombie you control. And, uh, and by the way, guys, sorry for the background noise. We're again at a Denny's. So and there's like yeah, no Taylor Swift this time, but uh, hopefully you guys can hear us. So. For some reason, Next. we don't like doing deck profiles in anyone's house. Hey, I tried. You guys don't want to drive out. You live in Egypt. I'm right down the street. <laughs> Next is the hand traps. Three ash, because, by the way, all the hand traps in this deck are zombies. That's really keen for this deck. And it fits the theme. Yep, three ash. Two ghost bell. And then just because I, I can... I can play this, and I really haven't done much with it. One, one ghost sister and do spooky dogwood. I've done this once so far, but it's good. Especially when you're playing something, say, I don't know, Cubix or Crusadia. Next for the updated part of this deck, because all that was basically standard. From the last, from the last deck, except for probably the hand traps. I play dangers now. You're on the injured species list. Upstart play... goblin, the architect. Yes. I play two of each of the ones you can only play two of. Two Mothman, because kind of like that uh, that Dark World dealings effect. And I guess I know they're mismatched mismatch, uh, rarity. Why? I'm sorry. And then one shoot, one Bigfoot, one Thunderbird, 
and that's basically all the, uh, the necessity of the danger engine. All the dangers. I believe that's 13 dangers. If I count correctly, yeah. Or no, 11. 11 dangers. I'm in danger. 11 dangers. You're always in danger. <laughs> next, Essentially. next to the spells. Yes, that is all monsters. That's a big chunk. <laughs> that's a big chunk of monsters. Uh, next is the spells. The heart and soul of the deck. Without this, this deck could not run properly. Um, zombie world. Zombie world. Makes everything in the field and graveyard zombie. Curse seal of the forbidden spell that cries. And he'll order it. He'll cry. He'll just rage quit. Next is another thing that the, the, the bearded bastard hates. Three super volley. It's not just me. Everybody hates that. <laughs> Yeah, but my archetype has its own fusion target. <laughs> <laughs> Next is two instant fusion. You forget with Zombie World on the field, your opponent can do that to your board too. Yeah, but what are the chances that they're going to be running it? It's happened. You know it has. Not to me anyways. I know the other people it has. Plus your whole thing is dark. Yeah, that too. Then for the one ofs, one one for one. One Foolish Burial, and one Monster Reborn. So. Where's Claude the Hunter for the true zombie field? Um, I don't know, actually. I just didn't put it in here. It would be way too, way, too much, too, way too many cards. Way too classy. And then the card that Bearded Bastard hates. Again. Again. Cheeky ass. Two rivalry war warlords. I cut this down to two to make him a little happier, but he's still not satisfied. Play Mystic Mind. No, I need the feel I need I need Zombie World. Um by the way by the way, if uh if you guys are wondering, Bearded Bastard pulled a knife on uh on uh baby hands here because he hates Mystic Mind that much. And then for the last two cards of the deck, two compulsory <laughs> two compulsory the evacuation device. This has come in Pretty, pretty good, I think. Pretty well. <laughs> it's the muffin button in trap form. All right, that was the main deck. Uh, I forget how many it is. I know it's way over 40. 67. Like, it's not 67, it's like 48. My bad, 69. It's like 48 or something like that, crazy. Um, now to the extra deck. Start off with two Drago, Drago Necro. Nether Soul. Nether Soul. Dragon. Uh, the, the super poly target for when I have Zombie World up on field. It's also a very good Dragon Spear target, too. Yeah? Assuming. Assuming, yeah. And then one Starving Venom for. That's always hungry. Another just a generic super poly target. Then for my super poly. I mean, not my super. My instant fusion targets. <coughs> one Sea C Monster Theseus. And one thousand eyes restrict. So those are the fusions. And then for the synchros, you play one red eye zombie necro dragon, which a really big beat stick late game. <laughs> I still want to know how it died. Honestly, me too. They probably lost the blue eyes. That's why it's blue. Because the flames are still in control. Yep. Then one Omega because you're playing zombies. You gotta play that. Sometimes, sometimes you gotta play that that old zombie combo where you just dump a Mizuki and someone back solitaire. <laughs> Plus he's still annoying. Yep. And then one Beals. Cubic's Cubic's bane of existence. You make this against when Crimson Nova's on field and have him burn you for three k. Hey, look at that. Beals, yeah. is, Beals is over six k. I did not think that clearly when I attacked. Yep. That was my bad. And then, just because I, I play a couple of uh, rank eights, I play one Hope Harbinger. Did you have a no Hope? Yep. And I didn't. And I also didn't really know what else to put in the in the extra deck. I have one slot open. Can and, you and the, anybody? I don't have that, sir. Zombie sign. Uh, that takes three. Oh, it takes two. No. It takes two? Two Oh, I'm sorry. I did not know that. I thought it was three. Oh, no. That's a uh, Coach King. Never mind. Uh, then for the links is one Link Revo for the Gull Bloom. Because sometimes you just you have no way of getting rid of, getting rid of it. So you so you play the one up, the one. Then the one Vampire Sucker. Really main uh, main main part of the opening turn combo. You get a draw on your opponent's turn. And then for the Nightmares, one Phoenix, one Cerberus, one Unicorn. <laughs> and then the, the ultimate boss monster of this deck, which I've done several times, one Borosword. 
which you guys don't know it's the reprint, it's not the not the secret. No IP Masquerina for the uniform? Sadly no. It's like what, like thirty bucks? Um, at the time of this recording, I think it's like thirty bucks or something. Uh, I would play that, but I don't know what to take out. <laughs> probably, probably the hope, honestly. Um, so that is that is thirty-eight dollars. Sorry. So that's the deck, guys. Ho hopefully, you guys liked it. Hit the like button. Comment down below what what you think or what I should change or give me a giant paragraph of uh, what you think. How how do you think the deck should run? Let us know what you think about Thunder Thighs' new nickname, Baby Hands. It is Baby Hands. It is, it officially, is, it is officially Baby Hands now. No. The that. almighty thunderous Old kaiju. Name, I'm going to print it out as a token. It's Baby Hands, the Thunder Thighs kaiju. Oh, no. they, yeah. I'm vetoing this. No, 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 no. Actually, no, the fairy has last day. Uh, I don't know if you get uh, Thunder Baby Hands. Thunder, <laughs> thunder, thunder Baby Hands. Okay, that's it. Right there. You guys have a great night. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.